the last episode, we have installed Laravel, View Router, Burma, and basic settings. So let's just firstly do very important thing. That means the creating GitHub repository. So what I will do, I will firstly open and check it via PHP artisan serve command. So yes, it is here. And if I go to localhost colon 8000, everything is working absolutely fine. So let's open GitHub. So github.com slash bitfumes and I will go uh, firstly I have to sign in so sign in okay so now what I will do I will create a new repository so I will go here and say new repository and repository name is simply phone book that's okay and here I will say Laravel plus Vue.js plus Burma plus View Router Phone Book App. That's okay. And it is public. Obviously, this is for you. Initializing with no, we don't have to do because I have already project in our system. So create repository and it's created and it says whether you like to create a new repository or you want to push the existing code in your repository so yes i want to push that existing code into repository so firstly i have to say git remote add origin all these things i have to write it so go to terminal close it and before doing anything what i am going to do i am going to show you something so you can see I have this git ignore which is going to ignore node modules which is going to ignore public slash hot storage uh, sorry then storage then vendor all these things these things are are ignored by uh, the git thing that means if I publish this on github repository all these things are not going to publish but for you to have no problem I'm going to delete everything except this node module folder modules folder because this folder has lots of file and that we don't need in our project so what you have to do when you clone or download this repository from my github slash bitfumes then you have to just run npm install okay save this and go to terminal and stop the server firstly i have to say git in it it will initialize git then i have to go here and copy this link and paste it here so it will add new repository to this project and then i have to give everything to the master but before that i have to say git status so it's having nothing in its uh, tracking so you can see there is no node modules folder because we have ignored it so let's git add all which is adding everything and it will take some time because there are lots and lots of file so it will take some time and then git commit with a hyphen m flag i will say initial commit and hit enter and now it's committed okay that's good and git status once more which says directory is cleaned that's very nice okay so now what we have to do we have to say this thing this git push origin master hit enter and now it will upload each and everything by firstly compressing then writing object then it will upload to github repository we have created so when it will be done i will come back and now you can see it's having only 7.21 MB of data written and it's now just writing to the server and which is completed. So let's go and reload our repository and we should get our code which is here. Everything is now here and we have to congratulate ourselves because we have committed everything on the server. So what we have to do? Let's first say git status. Everything is cleaned. And now what we have to do, go to sublime 
and let's open web.php file and here instead of returning this welcome i will going to return phone book dot blade dot php which i will create uh, right now so go to views then phone book dot blade dot php and we have to write and html5 and hit tab this is because of the emit package on the sublime if you don't know about these things check out the sublime series okay so that's good and let's create a div with the id of app because we have to connect our vue.js component vue.js element with this okay so we have created this that's very nice and now we have to give here link where i am going to give asset and here i will say css slash app.css where is this file this file is inside public css app.css similarly we have js app.js file so let's get this js file also so script source and this also having asset and using asset because it will get the project base url before everything so asset then js slash app dot js okay that's very nice and let's open terminal say php artisan serve go to chrome reload the page everything is good because we don't have anything but in the console you can see it says view is running that's very good and what is here going on is that let's go to sublime and now we don't have to care about this very much close this close this also go to assets file folder then js then app.js and you can see we have this all these things so let's close these comments okay so here we have this element app element so i will firstly say when it is created i want to do something console dot log and let's say hello world every programmers best friend hello world okay so we have done this but we are not getting anything in the console because this file we have to compile first to compile this we have to go here uh, let's create another shell so i will open new tab so new tab here i will say npm run watch and what it will do it will going to webpack or laravel mix laravel mix will get this file or this sas app.scss file and combine these two js and css file into this file app.css and app.js you can see we have this with that webpack.mix.js this file is having the details so it says mix what we have to mix we have to mix resources assets js app.js this means resources assets js app.js to public slash js so we have to compile this into this file which is inside public js app.js okay similarly for css file and you can also add these things so we don't have to do that thing so i'm just telling you where webpack or laravel mix is doing okay so we have this console go to chrome reload the page yeah you can see we have the hello world here this means our view is now working correctly so all these things are here and now from the next episode we are going to start creating the component using verma and much more so stay tuned for this series because this is going to be a great series and we are going to learn many concepts don't forget to subscribe like bit fumes on facebook twitter and instagram we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye